What do you see in the economy and, and what you're seeing in your companies, your operating companies, and from an investor's point? Well, our, our company, business has come back very well from five years ago when the panic hit. And it was a panic like nobody's ever seen. I mean, whatever you think about it, it was worse. Uh, uh, I, I'm dead serious about that. We were right on the edge of the cliff. Uh, and fortunately, I give enormous credit to uh, uh, both Ben Bernanke uh, and Hank Paulson and, and uh, Tim Geithner. And, and frankly, even though I didn't vote for him, never voted for him, uh, President Bush, uh, uh, you know, I don't know how many of you have studied economics, but in Adam Smith, they talk about comparative advantage and, 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 and uh, you know, uh, Keynes talked about animal spirits and all those people. But President Bush really came out with the great economic insight of all times. And he did it in 10 words in September of 2008. He went out there from the White House and he said, if money doesn't loosen up, this sucker could go down. And I mean, that, that goes right up there. Tear down those plaques of Adam Smith. <laughs> and, and, and he backed up. He backed up those fellows. And, and so it, we've come back from it. But business has come back. You know, a lot of companies are having record profits, including many of ours. And the American populace as a whole has not come back. I mean, the inequality is getting wider. The, the Forbes 400, which just came out, showed aggregate wealth for the Forbes 400 of $2 trillion. You go back 20 years and that was 300 billion. So it's up six or seven for one. It's different people to some extent, but this is the top. 300 billion to 2 trillion. And if you read the paper today, you'd have seen that the median income, you know, is the same place it was in terms of real purchasing power. Uh, from 1989, it hasn't changed. So it's, the inequality is getting wider. Uh, the rich are doing extremely well, extraordinarily well. Uh, and uh, business is doing well. Business profit margins are terrific compared to the record historically. Business returns on tangible equity are terrific. Uh, but most, you know, a great many people in our country, if you take the bottom 20% of households, that's 20, 24 million households or something like that, housing, you know, close to six, about 60 million people, you know, it's, the top level is $22,000. You know, I don't want to try to live on $22,000 with a couple of kids. So it, we've, got, we've got an economy that is delivering $50,000 of GDP per capita, and we've got an awful lot of people that aren't living well. So it, we, we have learned how to turn out lots of goods and services, but we haven't learned as well how to have everybody share in the, in the bounty that we have.